Good morning, sweet home. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance in a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, sweet home. Today's Thursday, May 21st, 2020. My name's Matt Carlini and here are today's morning announcements. Each day we will honor senior students as they make their plans for next fall in our segment called the Senior Spotlight. Today, our first senior to celebrate is Ariel Barbopoulos. Ariel plans to attend Niagara University for political science. Congratulations, Ariel. Our next senior to celebrate is our very own Michael Trudeau. Michael Trudeau is going to Los Angeles Film School for directing. Congrats, Michael. Thank you for everything you've done on the morning announcements. Advisors for the Connect Life Club, Ms. Liberta and Ms. Odzik would like to take a moment and congratulate senior club member Aliyah Hodge as being the 2020 recipient for the Units Connect Life Scholarship for her participation and hard work in spreading the organization's message. Congrats to Aaliyah, you deserve it. Hey everyone, I'm Michael Torito. The Sweet Home Music Department came together to lift our spirits up again. This time, they recorded their version of the song, Soul Man. Soul Man was originally recorded in 1967 by the artists Sam and Dave, who won a Grammy for this song. Hope you enjoy it. That's all from us for today, sweet home. Hope everyone is safe. Be sure to keep checking your email every day for updates from your teachers and counselors. Now stay tuned for more announcements.
And now for Media of the Day with Senior Alex Biondo. Hey, hey Speedo, my, my name is Alex Biondo, and welcome back to another Media of the Day. Happy Thursday, everyone. Today's Media of the Day is a TV show that you can find on Hulu called Modern Family. I'll read you a bit about it. Todd, from the perspective of an unseen documentary filmmaker, the series offers an honest, often hilarious pers- perspective of family life. Parents Phil and Claire earn for an <clears throat> honest relationship with their three kids, but a daughter who is trying to grow up too fast, another who is too smart for her own good, and a rambunctious young son make it challenging. Claire's dad, Jay, and his Latina wife, Gloria, are raising two sons together, but people sometimes believe Jay to be Gloria's father. Jay's gay son, uh, Mitchell, and his partner, Cameron, have adopted a little Asian girl uh, completing one big straight gay multicultural traditional happy family it is a uh, a really really good uh show uh for the whole family it is uh on abc you can find it on abc or hulu uh, i believe that uh the final season 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 11 just finished and so um yeah it's a definitely an in, an interesting uh tv show to get into if you just uh are bored and uh, need something to watch. But uh, anyways, I hope you guys like this review, and I will see you guys tomorrow for the next one. Bye! This is from Tara Venn, who is a dietitian from California. She posted some tips about staying healthy during this time. A lot of people talk about how mental health is tied to getting good sleep. Here are some ways to help better your mental health. First up is drink chamomile tea. It contains apogen, which promotes sleepiness. If you don't like chamomile tea, give passion flower tea a try. Passionflower tea can reduce anxiety. This also has apogen, which can make you sleepy and have an overall calming effect. Next up, almonds. Almonds are a great source of melatonin and magnesium. Magnesium is a mineral that may help sleep quality. Try eating a handful of almonds two hours before bed or have an almond dessert after dinner. Turkey is the next recommendation to help achieve better sleep. Turkey contains tryptophan, which increases the production of the sleep-regulating hormone melatonin. The last suggestion for better sleep is tart cherry juice. Tart cherries contain a high content of melatonin which can help you have a good night's rest. Remember, leave time to digest before bed. Eating just before bed can cause digestive issues which will affect your sleep. Thank you so much for watching the third installment of the Mental Health series. Stay tuned for more episodes coming soon. Attention Sweet Home families, if you are in need of any meals during this time, please know that meals are available at schools and sites within our community. Meals are distributed at Glendale Elementary, Maplemere Elementary, Heritage Heights Elementary, Willow Ridge Elementary, and the Sweet Home Middle School. Meals are also available at Ring Tree Island Apartments in front of the playground, Amherst Baptist Church on the corner of Pepper Tree and Willow Ridge, the Sutton Place Apartments near 237 Traverse Boulevard, at the intersection of East and West Somerset Lanes, at the intersection of Glenhaven Drive and Vine Lane, on the corner of Hartford and Millersport Highway, on Elm Circle in the Buckeye Road area, at the corner of Bear Haven and Azure Pine Court, and at the North Bailey Fire Department on Sweet Home Road. If you have any questions regarding meals and their availability, contact Sandy Coca, the District Food Service Director, at 716-250-1446, or go to www.sweethomeschools.org for more information. Hey, Sweet Home families. Here's some additional local assistance from food pantries near you. We know this is a difficult time for many in our Sweet Home community. Local food pantries are available to help Sweet Home families. If you and your family are in need of food from a local pantry, you can call the numbers on the screen and you'll be informed of which pantries to be followed. Check out the food pantries listed below for your zip code and which location can serve you and your family. Options for Sweet Home families include New Beginnings Food Pantry on Willow Ridge Drive, St. Christopher's Food Pantry on Ellica Creek Road, St. Vincent de Paul's Food Pantry on Sweet Home Road, St. Paul Tiger Den on Main Street, Town Square Food Pantry on North Forest Road, and University Presbyterian Church on Main Street. At this point, families do not need to call St. Christopher's or New Beginnings ahead of time. They can just show up at one of the distribution days. St. Leo's needs a call because they deliver the food. It may take a day or two before one receives a call back. All food pantries are operating as drive through resources. If you do not have transportation, please call the Sweet Home Family Support Center at 250-1229 
and we will make arrangements for food delivery. Again, if you have any questions on any of this information, please call the Sweet Home Family Support Center at 250-1229. We are all in this together. We are Sweet Home. Thank you.